The Yam 3 mission was a really great opportunity for Leo Stella to take our robust heritage bus with an existing inventory and really extend those capabilities out to create a multi mission bus platform. We redesigned the whole structure to accommodate the Yam payload hub, which is five times heavier with a larger volume compared to our heritage payload. It also uses eight times higher power, so we had to design new con ops to utilize an additional solar array. We also redesigned the payload interface to be compatible with Loft's distributed computing system which pushes large amounts of data at high throughput for multiple data processors. By combining the strengths of the Leo Stella design team and our existing hardware inventory, we were able to deliver on an aggressive schedule while also minimizing technical and programmatic risks. The Loft Orbital Payload Hub has five payloads on board the YAM-3 spacecraft. We have two RF payloads that are IoT from space in-orbit demonstrations, we also have two imagers, an externally mounted 30 meter multispectral imager used for cloud imaging, and an internally mounted monochromatic 5 meter imager, which is actually being used to support multiple missions, including our last payload, which is an onboard computer uh, that will be used by DARPA for a blackjack technology demonstration. This is nothing short of a record-breaking moment for Loft and Leo Stella. Our team's collaboration and successful execution of an aggressive schedule is a true testament to everyone who worked on this program. Our ability to adapt to rapid changes is just one more example of Leo Stella's flexibility and innovation. To everyone who made this collaboration successful, thank you so very much.